What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the Strike Up Beer Podcast. I'm RD Flying Solo tonight. Happy freaking Friday to you. Just wanted to pop in, have a beer. It's happy hour, baby. It's 4 o'clock on a beautiful Friday. A little chilly here in North Texas, but the temperatures seem to be going up. I did look down on my phone, or uh, the thing before I got going, and it said uh, temperatures are supposed to plummet tonight. I'm like, I think that was like last night. Because tomorrow it's supposed to be warmer than it was today, so I don't know, I don't know what's going on. And I got this bright light on my face, so like I'm trying to answer questions from Congress or something. But anyways, old school in the house. What is going on, sir? How are you? Put the comments above us now. I did zoom out a little bit on the camera. Because I felt like last week, you know, Lizzie was like, you're, you're, it's all, it's just your face, man. <laughs> so uh, tonight we're having, it's Tucker, Toucher, I, I think it's just Tucker Fest, Fest Beer. Um, you can't obviously see the can, it's green, I got a green screen on. But uh, authentic Bavarian special lager, a full body golden Fest Beer with naturally bound finish, brewed and bottled in Germany, brewed in accordance with the Bavarian purity law. So if you know anything about the purity law, all you can have are like uh, three ingredients. Which uh, I should know them off the top of my head. I think it's water, yeast, barley, and hops. If I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, your beer emporiums over there on uh, Instagram. How are we doing? Oh my god! It foamed up on me. I didn't shake this up, and I don't. I don't have a towel. I don't know why I don't, but I just don't. Oh god! This is just going as great as it can go. You know what I mean? Uh, let me go ahead and finish topping this off. It actually looks really good. I think this came in a four pack. I can't remember if I picked this up a solo or if I already uh, if this was a four pack. So got my Dallas Stars cup. Go Stars! Oh yeah, it smells good. See the clarity on it. I mean, you can see my face right through it. If you're watching this on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch, or Kick, but uh, yeah. Oh yeah, that smells good. Old school. What are you getting into this weekend? Anything fun? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's good. That's real good. Now, I do like fest beers. I'm more of a fest beer guy than I am, like, say, a Marzen. You know, when they say Oktoberfest, hey, Lizzie, how you doing, babe? When you say uh, Oktoberfest, a lot of people think about, like, the Marzen beers and things like that. Um, that's definitely what I used to think of, but it's more of a, a fest beer for me. That's what I like. That's the kind of, it's a little bit lighter, less sweet, you know. Bruh, what's up? What's up, man? How are you? Hope everybody's doing all right tonight. But yeah, I just wanted to pop on a little happy hour. I'm going to have me a beer and just start to relax. You know, I don't know. My Friday nights kind of just go wherever. Nothing really special um, until something just kind of happens, right? I might hang around all night, might sit on the couch. I don't know. But uh, we've been known to just all of a sudden, we're going to go somewhere. We're going to go out. We're going to do something. So fancy in the house. How are we doing? Hello. How are we doing? KU versus Colorado tomorrow, football on Sunday, just doing stuff around the house. I feel you. Yeah, we had to do a lot of crap around the house as well. Uh, Kentucky plays Texas tomorrow at 630. Got a uh, grandkid's birthday party I got to go to as well. So tell me about uh, Jesus, your, your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. No, that's about all I know, man. Uh, have a very nice Thanksgiving. Thank you. I hope you do as well. Hey, good looking. How you doing? Uh, I got your question, bro. I got it right here. Do you put milk in cereal or cereal than milk? If you put milk in the bowl first, you are a certified psychopath, okay? Bowl, cereal, milk, right? The only time, the only freaking time that you're allowed to put cereal on milk is if you've already finished the bowl, but you didn't drink the milk already. And you're like, you know what? I want, to, I want, another, I want another go. And then you throw the cereal in, you'll give it a little extra milk to finish her off there. Yeah, that's just... That's just insane, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I hope everybody has a good Thanksgiving. Um, that's one thing I'm looking forward to, obviously, this week. Um, you know, my wife's off all work, all week. I get to work from home uh, Monday and Tuesday, and then I'm off the rest of the week, vacation, holiday. So um, it just, you know, have everybody together in town, sitting around the house, watching football. You know, it's always a good time. Nim Vin, how are we doing? I don't. I don't have the translator. I don't know what that says. Sorry, buddy. Recently, a thirty-three foot long snake was found. I think it died later, though. Uh, yeah. If I saw, if I if I saw a ten foot snake, I'd probably have a heart attack. Let alone thirty-three. Yeah. No. It's a. It's a no for me. Like I, it, it, snakes are the scariest thing to me. That's my, you know, my wife, she's terrified of spiders. You got people that are scared of all this other, whatever. Snakes for me, 
And then also, I don't really, if I come across a snake, I pretty much got to eliminate the snake from the population. You know what I mean? It's just, it's what we have to do here. Sorry. I'm, so, I'm sorry about that. But yeah, I have to. Personally, I love snakes. I know a lot of people that do like snakes. And my wife, like, she's one of them. You know, we go down to like, uh, say, Mexico or something like that, Cancun, and they, you know, they'll bring the snakes out. Uh, there's it's usually like one or two per, uh, people there with a big old, is it a boa? They're, they have the one that I think is a boa snake. It's got the brown, black, gold, or copper. And then you have the other ones like the yellow snake. And it's gigantic. And I, I got I to look like down down on the ground and just start walking or, or get away because I can't, I can't handle it. I really can't. Yeah, it scares the ex- absolute F out of me. So but my wife loves it. She'll she'll put the snakes on her, you know, whatever. Uh, I I can't do it. I I, I can't even look at her afterwards. <laughs> Billy Joe's in the house. What's up, brother? How are we doing? You have seen Florida spiders. I've seen some Florida spiders. Oh God! But Black Mamas uh, are in top hand. No, 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 no. Python either. No, thank you. No, thank you. Like I was camping one time. Billy Joe, I don't have Facebook up. Let me know how many days it comes back on that follow, which I guarantee it's been like three years or four years. Um, but I, we were camping one time uh, at a nearby lake, and a group of people were like, hey, just FYI, there's some cotton moss over there. I was like, and I pretty much couldn't, like I'm freaking out now, like my legs and feet have kind of gone up under me, and I'm, that's all I can think about. But anyways, I was like, all right, I, I can't. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. So I had a, a, a bunch of beers. 1,506 days. Holy moly, brother. Thank you. Cheers to that. Cheers to you. Sorry, it does look a little weird. I got, a, obviously, a green screen. I'm not sitting there in front of downtown Dallas sun, uh, Sunset right now. Whoo. Kansas. Uh, what's that? Kansas, uh, Kansas cro- across the world join. Hey, thanks. Or right, welcome in. Welcome in. Sorry I butchered that name, man. I just It's a tough one for me. Honestly, I'd rather go face-to-face with a, uh, I don't know what that word is, than fight a black mama. I don't, I don't know what that is. I don't want to look it up either because I don't want to see it on my screen. But do I Do I really want to look it up? I kind of want to look it up now. Don't make me look this up. If I look, oh, it's a dinosaur. That thing's got wings. I can't even say that word. I don't even know. Where's the shamrock board? It's over in the corner, Billy Joe, Billy Joe. I, I, Maybe one day I'll have Lizzie stand right behind me and just hold it up or something, you know what I mean? Because I, I don't, I mean, I could pretty much, I, 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 listen, I could suspend a board from the ceiling here, a big old chalkboard, and you've got me thinking, you've got me thinking, and I, I, I'm, I'm going to see what I can do. Lizzie, you're in here. I need a, what do you think, a four by six chalkboard, Okay. I'll draw you a big veiny tree, a mushroom, or whatever. Ooh, follow it. David, uh, old school, tell me how many days it was. Like, you, you, you've probably got Billy Joe beat by just a little bit, just, just by a little bit there. Non, uh, non-avian? Okay. Yeah, they're pretty much a velociraptor and steroids. Jesus, yeah, I'm out. Out. I am so freaking out. Can't do it. Can't do it. So, yeah, it, weekend's upon us. You know, I'm sitting there. I got home today. I worked like a half day in the office, got home. And I started to, oh, 1,581, got them, by, got them by a little bit. I like that. Got them by a couple months. <laughs> um, got home. The bulk trash people aren't picking up our, we we trimmed our tree. And when we're at, we can put, we can stack the stuff out front. They'll come by and pick it up. They picked up the ladies across the street like three weeks ago. And then they just keep skipping by my house. I don't understand why. And so I'm like, well, you know, it's actually some good logs in there. So I went, I was like, you know what, if it's, it's already been today, if they don't pick it up today, I'm going to go ahead and start chopping stuff up. And um, get it ready just to kind of sit for a year, and then we'll have it as firewood. I'll split it up or use even, I mean, I'll go through pretty much all that um, stuff. But it was like, I don't know, a 10-foot by 3-foot tall pile. I mean, it was pretty it was decent. I mean, I I don't know why it sat out there for so long. Then I saw some jackass through someone else trimmed a tree and then threw their stuff in my yard. So I chunked his shit in the street. Grab my stuff, but I started going through all my crap, and I was like, you know what? Either I'm gonna go. I was like, I don't think it's my neighbor. I think it's my neighbor's landscaper that did that. And I was like, you. Son of, I was like, I'll see you on Wednesday. I know when you come by. And then there's a Biscetti giant and a Utah raptor. Mm, nice. So, but yeah, I'm gonna kind of chill this weekend. Nothing crazy. Um, I do got to do some reorganization in the in the shed. I am looking forward to being home for a week. 
so we can get some stuff done around here. The backyard's still kind of a mess. You know, we had a big old patio poured, and we're still kind of trying to figure out what we're going to do with some areas. Oh, man, I tell you, that's that's what gets me to drinking, really. It, you know, just thinking about all the the responsibilities and stuff that I got to get, you know, taken care of. Got a house full of people. This Thursday should be bonkers. Kids running all over the place, you know. I mean, we weren't even going to have Thanksgiving, um, what was it, last year? Last year, I think my wife was like, you know what, let's just go to the Cowboy game. I'm like, we can if you want. I mean, she's not a Cowboy fan, and neither am I, but she likes going to the games. And, uh, you know, because the kids, we couldn't figure out what time. We have adult children. Couldn't figure out what time everybody was going to come over. So my wife's like, you know what, we ain't doing it. They were calling, like, hey, what time's things? We ain't going to be here. Don't stop by. And so... I was like, let's just calm down real quick. So then a lot of freaking calls and texts and stuff like that went on. And then all of a sudden everybody, everybody showed up. Everybody was here. So it was, it actually turned into a really fun day. Um, stayed up way too late on Thursday or on Wednesday. Cause drinks giving for strikeout beer Wednesday before we generally stay up rather late and we did again. So I pretty much was laid up on the couch a lot of the, a lot of the day, you know, just trying to relax and watch some football and get up and eat. And I was just, I felt like crap, but this year should be just, just a, just a slight different, slight different. The spaghetti gi- uh, giant, am I saying that right? Besetki. Uh, maybe that's right. Besetki. Uh, giant is estimated to be around 25 feet long. If I had to guess, which is longer than a uh, Utah Raptor, though it's still uh, fragmentary. That... 25 feet long. Jesus. No, thank you. Yeah. No, no, thank you. I don't want any part of that. So, but looking forward to it. I mean, y'all got any plans old school? You got any big plans for uh, Thanksgiving? Billy Joe? Fancy? Anybody in here? Who's the one guy that asked me about the Jesus Christos there? Yeah. Oh, man. So... Well, hope everybody, uh, well, one, thanks to everybody who popped in for the, the live stream Wednesday. We had a lot of fun, talked a, you know, a ton of crap about everything. And then, uh, obviously, with Fantasy Football, it's been going quite well. And the, the channel that we're on for that is SP Fantasy Football. So, it's it's busy, you know. Uh, I had a buddy of ours come in there, Whiskey. You know, he was, like, asking if we were going to stream anymore. I was like, I don't know. And I thought about it. Um, I thought about streaming today. I really did um, under RD. And I didn't, but I'll tell you what I did do. I fired up Fort and I played Rocket League for like three or four games, maybe four. And I was like, you know what I haven't played is uh, Fortnite. So I was like, I fired up Fortnite. Jumped in. Obviously, your first, if, whenever you jump in and you haven't been on a long time and it's like a new season, new whatever, you're going to get a win, right? As long as you don't do anything crazy. And so I'm sitting there mowing through people, just running them over in cars. And. Then towards the end, you know, that's when you kind of start getting some other live players. This dude, I had the high ground, and he was just sitting there trying to snipe and, you know, whatever. And I just kind of sat there and was like, okay, well, you got to come to me, you know. And then the storm kind of, it's just perfect setup, and you win. Uh, it was just like, I just waited. I, he was running through the storm. He got out of the storm, was like trying to pop. I just shot him. It was like boom, bang, boom. And, uh, yeah, that's a win. I went in there and tell Lizzie about it because I was like, you know what, I just, just play Fortnite. She goes, you get the high score? I go, I did get the high score did uh spinosaurus uh being the longest theropod at around 45 feet 45 feet 14 meters molson's in the house what's up dude how are you good to see you cheers molson what are y'all getting into this week or this uh well thanksgiving's not for y'all this week but uh this weekend i mean y'all do anything cool is it getting a little chilly up that way i know every time i say it gets cold down here you know you just kind of scoff at us scoff at me or whatnot but uh yeah it's uh it was like 39 when I went outside this morning or yesterday morning. I was like, that's brisk, baby. And of course, you know, I don't, we don't dress accordingly ever because, you know, we're down here in Texas. It's like, yeah, we just wear, you know, shorts and t shirts and stuff. Now I did have jeans on because I was going to work. But uh, like Thursday, I didn't like, yes, yeah, yesterday I, I was like, I'm going to go get my hair cut. I had shorts and t shirt and flip flops on. Lizzie's like, you going outside like that? I go, yeah, I get my hair cut indoors. They don't, there's no, you know, I'm going to be outside for like a total of 20 seconds, so I should be just fine. Just fine. As long as that 13 tons, that's too, uh, Tyrannosaurus. Oof. Uh, coaching hockey? Oh, yeah? You coach like Pee Wee or something? I guess your kids, right? Your kids play hockey? Molson, how old are you? Like, I, uh, you know, I, I never, I, don't, I know we never talk about it. I'm stumbling all over the place. But yeah, I'm like, I'm 40 plus here. I feel like you're way younger than I am. Yeah, no, I I never coached my kids in any sports. I was there, sideline, you know, but uh, 
you know, I got asked to coach uh, Tyler in baseball one time. I was like, no, nah, I just can't do it. They go, yeah, you, come on, man, you can do it. I go, no, I don't want to do it. And I'm not going to, I'm not going to do it. How about that? I was like, <laughs> four F today and minus four Fahrenheit here. Good God. That's cold. That's a little too cold. Like, so I want to go out west or north, northwest. Um, you're 43? Okay. Is that how old I am? I just turned 44. Yeah. I was like, Jesus Christ, is that how old I am? I have to look at the year, you know. But, um, yeah, I I wanted to go north. I want to go up to Montana, um, Wyoming, Utah, you know, Colorado. And I don't know if I'm going to make it up that far in the next couple of months. I think we're just going to end up going to New Mexico, head up to – was it uh, towels or angel fire for like a week or two? Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Nice. U18 uh, double A. Nice. That's cool, man. But I, I, it's not like I ski. I don't snowboard or anything like that. I never, I've never done either one. Even though I've been told I can do it. Cause it's like, they say it's a lot like ice skating and, you know, skateboarding and stuff like that, which, you know, wakeboarding, I'd be able to get the the hang of it. I just, I'm nervous about, uh, obviously, you know, being old and smacking the ground or something else equally hard and getting hurt. I'm tired of being, I'm tired of getting hurt. That's one thing I am. Beer, uh, Beerly Alive over there and uh, Beer's Beard Podcast. How we doing over there on Instagram? Cheers. Yeah, I'd be afraid I get hurt. I just don't want to get hurt. I, here, here's what I want. I want like a cabin in the woods with snow all around. Just hang out. I got to have Wi-Fi, obviously, because I got to work. And we're going to bring Tilly with us. And I just want to sit there. I want to be able to go put the beer in the snow outside and sit and chill, have a fire and a hot tub, and just relax. Just just, just want to relax. That's all I want to do. So TJ Burns, David Sprague, appreciate those likes on Facebook. Oh, sorry, Whiskey, how you doing, buddy? I almost went live today. If you're, if, if you're still in here, if you're listening, yeah, I almost went live today. And it was going to be just for you. Maybe tomorrow. I don't know. I'm skipping the gym right now. To, to hang out with you fine folks and, and drink a cold one. Uh, now, this beer, real quick, I mean, this is what we're having, so why not talk about it just a, just a hair. This is from the uh, Browery Tucker Brow, uh, Germany, obviously. Uh, so, Wines Beer Fest Beer, it's ranked number nine, according to this, according to Beer Advocate. You got a 5.8% alcohol by volume, score is 90, um, a 4.02 that's a pretty damn high score. Uh, Review 60, ratings 125. It's active. First added on August 30th, 2021. It says rated August 25th, 2024. To many, the Fest Beer of Bavaria are a liquid voyage of the, to the tents of Oktoberfest. For Tucker, nestled in its home in northern Bavaria, Bavaria, uh, and out of the reach of festivals that overtake Munich's fairgrounds each fall, the focus is for Froling Fest. And celebrating at the end of a cold winter months, uh, as such, this fest beer is brewed in a full-bodied uh, Hellas lager with slightly louder presence of old world hops instead of the Marzen, and is available at festivals year round. I do like Hellas. I uh, we were at what three nations, a handful of uh, actually last Sunday, and that's what I was having. I was just having the Hellas beer. I love Hellas. Uh, it's a great style, easy drinker. Um, it's just easily poundable. It's just poundable, right now. Over on tapped, it says six percent. So I don't know. It's got the same, the right pictures on it. It's been checked in about ten thousand times. Eighty five hundred, eighty six hundred. Those are unique. One hundred fifty average monthly. Um, Three point six seven on that one. Out of seventy seven hundred and forty four ratings. So Margaret R uh, checked it in two hours ago. Yeah. So people were out there drinking this. So yeah, good, good. Uh, what do we got? What's up, Nutsack? Speaking of Nutsacks, I need you to. Oh God, what do you need to send me? I don't, I don't, I don't know what it, I don't know. Hey, won't you just come meet up with me and Alan tomorrow? I got to go meet up with him for, I got to drop up some prints and some other things. I think we're going to meet at uh Hoppet's thing at Grapevine. If you want to go over there at some point. Uh, it's around 18 tons. And I believe about 50 feet. Jesus. It's way too big. I can't imagine like seeing something that large, especially like in, in it moving around like, holy moly. 50 feet. I mean, nah. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. There's nothing I can do about it. Nothing I can do about it. Yeah, uh, whiskey. If you want to, yeah, I'm going to talk to Alan. It's going to be some tomorrow, uh, sometime tomorrow around noon. I know. That's what she said. That's what she said. Um, but, yeah, I, I just, yeah. we're going to meet up tomorrow, I think. Yeah, because we got to go to, I got to go to Penn Stack for a birthday party. And I was like, I don't know if I want to go. You know, she's like, we can just hang out at the bar and have some drinks. I go, well, I can do that. <laughs> I can, I can definitely do that. I can't even say that word. Shantagosaurus. 
Genticosaurus uh, could kill a Tyrannosaurus most of the time. What? I thought a Tyrannosaurus was the like the biggest. Yeah, the biggest and somewhat baddest. I don't know about the baddest. Like when you're growing up, that's what the big the the coolest one was, right? Um, and then you come to find out there's like a billion other ones. Yeah, like Stegosaurus, and I remember like is that the one with the little plates on the the spine going down the spine? Yeah, then all of a sudden, you know, Jurassic World comes out, and there's like a million other ones. Like, jeez, I had no idea. I didn't even know. Didn't even know. Uh, I have a cabin in the woods. Just need to uh, bring Starlink. There you go. I can crash. Well, thanks. I missed those comments, Molson. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, I just don't want to hit anything. I don't want to get hurt. That's all That's all it is. I don't want to get hurt skiing. But I think I might try. If we go for, like, so the plan, the initial plan was to go for three or four weeks. Because we can work out. Of I, I, we can work anywhere, right? Um, and I was like, well, I don't want to be that away from the house for that long, just in case something let's, let's break it up. Like, you know, and I was like, let's go for like a week or two and then we can go somewhere else. You know, we could go up to Manhattan or go down to Florida, go to Miami, you know, get a, you know, get a break from the cold. And so, you know, she, she seems to be on board with it, but this won't be something until if we're going to do angel fire, it's probably going to be the last week or last half of January. It's going to be cold as hell. And so by the time February, February was around, we'll probably be wanting something a little bit more warm. So we might roll down to Miami. I don't know. Its height is over 60 foot. God, 60 foot tall. I'm now hooked to coolers on coolers light. I don't know why. You mean Coors Light? <laughs> Were you hanging out on a, on a, what the hell's the name of that thing? On Team Having Fun's page? Yeah. Big fan of Coors. Big fan. Jesus. But anyways, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get out of here. I gotta go. Hope you've all had a great Friday. Um, I'll give you my final thoughts on this beer as soon as I get a brief, uh, craft beer. JJ joined over there on Instagram. How we doing? It looks like Instagram's jumping around. I don't know if it is or isn't. So, Blue Dog and I can house sit uh, for you. All right. Okay. Okay. New sub. Oh, thank you so much for subscribing. I appreciate it. Thanks, Fancy. I really do. I appreciate that. I appreciate you telling me, too, because, of course, like I, I mentioned earlier, I don't have my Facebook creator studio up. I don't have my YouTube creator studio up. I don't have Twitch. None of the, none of the, none of the uh, no, you don't stay and drink. I, I got I got, I got a couple more minutes in me. How about that? Um, yeah, I, I, thank you very much. Yeah, sometimes I should have that kind of stuff up, but then I'm I'm got other pages up, and I'm just a terrible, terrible streamer. Terrible. It used to be easier when you just went to one place. You know, when I, when I, would stream through just, um, say, uh, was it Streamlabs? Go through Streamlabs. I'd be on Twitch only. Easy, right? Everything's just kind of right there. Um, it's just, it really is easy. And it was easier for my PlayStation 5 when I first started. So, it, anyway. Let's see. If I got a, oh, I do got a little bit left, Whiskey. Whiskey, what are you getting into this week? Or this weekend, excuse me. You got a big plans for Thanksgiving? If you enjoy this random dude drinking beer and talking, boo this man. That's what that's why I used to tell everybody, come on in and start booing me. Gal D uh, TX in the house over there on uh, on Instagram. How are we doing? Happy Friday to you. But yeah, I don't know. I I always just try to chill Friday afternoon, and then I have a couple drinks, and then I start. It just starts escalating, right? So I don't. And it'll be one of those things where we're sitting around, you know, watching something on TV or, you know, football, basketball, whatever, you name it. They're like, Hey, you know what? Let's go get some dessert. Let's just go to the, we'll go to like a uh, 54th street and get a beer and some dessert and a uh, 10 o'clock at nine. I'm like, this is, this is why I can't, this is why I can't lose weight. Uh, we were hosting Thanksgiving. Are you now? Awesome, man. Yeah. Big time. Yeah. Getting, doing a Cajun bird, deep fried bird. What are we doing there? No, we ain't, but no, no, no. Whiskey. Uh, you know, he, uh, that's how I used to say. I used to when I used to post that was going live. I'd say, "Hey, I'm going live. Or come on, check out the stream, and make sure you come in and boo." You know, the whole time. So they, you know, everybody would come in and just boo. Uh, this weekend we have a deep cleaning. Into, oh, buddy, it's I've been doing some deep cleaning around the house. And I've got one of those um, back those um, carpet cleaner things too, like for pets and stuff like that. And so I've been kind of just getting after getting. I mean, you know, when you get a bunch of people in the house. And it's like you you know that you one you want to downsize stuff you want to declutter declutter stuff right then you start seeing 
things that you need to fix or repair or fix and repair, same damn thing. Um, you know, upgrade, whatever, clean, deep clean. And it's, it, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a process. It's a process for sure. I hope it goes well. And I'm going to take the bike out for a ride before uh, the end. Oh dude. Yeah. I almost bought, um, what was it? Two weeks ago. It was the Friday after, or wait, no, it was the Wednesday before Halloween. And I had the, I found the bike I was going to get. It was a little, it, it's just a little Harley. It was, I think it was a Sportster or something like that. It was the 100th uh, anniversary one. So it was like an, it was 03 or something like that. And there was a Dyna out there too. Um, and I was like, okay, here we go. I'm just going to get one. F it. And Leslie was like, yeah, just get one. Shut up and get one. I was like, okay. And the lady I was going to go get it from, she was out of town. She's like in Oklahoma or something like that. My son was so excited because I was like, hey, I ain't got no license to drive this thing. I've been riding motorcycles since I was 15 years old, right? I've been riding dirt bikes since I was like 10, you know, but I don't feel I need the government to tell me what I can and can't do, right? So anyway, so he's, got a, he's got a motorcycle license. And so I was like, hey, I'm going to get this bike, but you're going to have to drive it home for me. He goes, what? You know, he's, he's mine's a race and he's so excited, you know, and, but, uh, but yeah, I, I just, I was like, all right, we got to chill, you know, we'll, we'll work on it. And then of course it just fell through, but I, I, there is a bike that I want. I actually want two of them. I want, I want to see, I want to get another sport bike. You know, you know, I love my sport bike. So, uh, beer fridge podcast in the house. How are we doing? Happy Friday. Happy hour to you. Happy. Yeah. Happy hour Friday. Uh, Briggs brewing bridges brewing, excuse me, uh, on Instagram as well. How are we doing? But yeah, I want to get back on and ride a little bit. You know, I just don't want anything too heavy. I don't want it too big of a bike. I want something that it's just going to be easy for me to kind of roll with. Uh, the only thing we're booing is KSI's newest song. I don't even know who KSI is. Who is KSI? Man, I'm old. I'm so old. It's an influencer. I, I shouldn't say it. He's an influencer. Oh, okay. Ever heard this song? Yeah, I don't know. Thick, thick of it. Yeah, I don't listen to. I don't know what that is. I don't know. I've been stuck in listening to uh, old Post Malone, old uh, was it Fatty Web? <laughs> like lately? Oh uh, yeah, traditional birds. Uh, traditional bird tons of food just buy the bike already i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna do it man just gotta give me some time i just need time and i gotta pick one out i gotta pick one out that i like you know what i mean i get this made a thousand by 2025 i don't know about all that you know it seems like we were on our way moving like you know because we have i don't know 2500 followers on facebook 2500 followers on instagram and whatnot but Facebook was our YouTube's just been kind of neglected because we didn't work on shorts and things like that. When I started do, introducing shorts, we grew a little bit and grew, you know, quite a bit. And so it's been fun. I actually really enjoy YouTube. That's one of my, I think, preferred platforms at this moment. So I appreciate that though. Lizzie's the house. What's up, babe? Uh, bro, 2024 passed. So it did. And that's one thing about my wife and I were talking about. It's just like the year flew, you know, I don't even like January is the longest month of the year. Always is. It's just forever. Right. And then March is a little slow as well. But after that, we're sitting there in summertime, just spring flu, summer, just shot right by, um, fall. It's just crazy. She goes, once school starts, you're going to, you know, it's all over again. Right. You know, you're going to be right smack dab into, uh, the middle of all the holidays, which were big Halloween folks. So, and, um, love Halloween, love Thanksgiving, Christmas as well. Just, um, yeah, love it, love it, love it. No time like the present. I know you're hungry. I just, I got a half a salad in here. I, I haven't got to. I've made the salad. Uh, have a beer, honey. That'll fill you up. Because now I'm not even hungry. That's something I heard on like on the internet, right? They were like, if you think you're hungry, just have a beer. You know, it'll probably fix it. Yeah. <laughs> you're doing a lot of talking. Talk. <laughs> I'll talk long. All I hear is blah 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 blah. <laughs> Listen. I'm working on it. I just want to find one that I like, you know, and I don't really, if I can find one for a couple grand, that's what I'm looking for. I'm not looking to spend 10 to 15 grand on a, on a bike that I don't even know if I like. If I get one, I'm like, okay, cool. This might be something I look, I'm, I can handle as far as the weight. Cause the bikes weigh like seven or 800, uh, seven or 800 pounds for no reason at all. Like why does it weigh that much? Cause it's not, it's not like it's the motor or, you know, for speed. So I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Care what people say. January was like last. It was. Yeah, yeah. 
It absolutely was. Feed Lizzie. Oh, she'll be fed. That's why she's not in there eating right now. Don't sing it, bring it, playboy. I, <laughs> I'll get it when I'm damn good and ready. All right? I'll get it when I'm ready. And I, I look every day, and I sometimes I, I throw some feelers out there. I throw some offers out there, and it just it hasn't happened yet. So I'm not uh, I'm not freaking out. Playboy's crazy. I'm not freaking out. I'm just kind of staying right there and just kind of keeping an even kill. And, uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. So we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I think a couple more months I'll have the, some somebody else. It'll get cold enough where people just start selling their bikes, you know, um, wintertime and stuff like that. Boats and bikes, best best time to, to buy them in the wintertime. Um, it's just the way it is, right? I bought my boat uh, that we had, like, years and years ago. I bought it in February. You know, I was like, yeah, let's get this bike. Got to get it. Let's get it. Or the boat, excuse me. I bought motorcycles in the winter and the fall and in yeah, I, I'm looking for a deal. I'm looking for a good bike, but I'm looking for a deal. You know, something uh, that's just been sitting around. And I don't need nothing crazy. Like I said, I, I I'd like to have a Dyna, but if I can't get a Dyna, I'm gonna just I'll probably get a, a small sports or just to screw around with for the time being, and uh, see if I even like the brand. I might go to Indian as well, or um, uh, there's another one out there. So I think my cat likes pillows. He always laying on one. <laughs> yeah, cats love pillows. Our dog loves pillows too. Yeah, she thinks she's a little princess or queen or whatever you want to call it. So, all right, um, you know what? I gotta, I gotta go. It's been thirty minutes. Let me, uh, let me slam this. Get out of here. Mm-hmm. Just do it, whiskey pro way. Spend way too much and cry about it later. God. <laughs> but uh, lazy, but uh, relatable. I love. Uh, we used to have a cat. He was indoor for a long, long time, but he never got to Claude. And so when we moved or whatnot, he just kind of wanted to be outside. So he, he went outside and stayed outside, roamed the neighborhood. He was a vicious little ass, though, man. He was mean. But uh, real snuggler to us, but just mean to other animals and anything that came in our yard. But, uh, yeah, indoor cats, they, cats are different. And I think if you've never had a cat, you just don't understand. But if you've had cats, they're just one that can be jerks. I mean, hell, one of them pulled a fish out of a fish tank. I, I don't. It, it's a whole other day, a whole other story. But uh, you know what? I appreciate everybody that's on Twitch right now, Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Instagram. Thank you so much for being here. Um, again, we're having Tucker's Fest beer. I'm actually, yeah, you can, I know what it looks like because it's a green can. I didn't think about it before I brought it in here. They usually struggle walking without a joint in their toe. Oh God. Um, but yeah, beer for me. Um, I love it. It's a great fest beer. It's got a great taste to it. Um, yeah, it, if you're looking for a little bit more clean, refreshing uh, fest beer, or if you're looking for an October fest beer, this is going to be more that up, up that way. You know, Marzins and whatnot, they're just a little bit more caramel, a little bit more malty, um, just sweet, right? And it's, it's you can tell, you can tell the uh, obviously the different difference because one's clear and golden, the other one is uh, semi-transparent and you know red, you know. Dark, like, man, well, red, brown, you know, whatever. Yeah, whatever. But uh, thumbs up for me. If you see it on your shelf, uh, pick it up. Check it out. Uh, everyone, I, I don't know if I'll be live Wednesday night. I might because, again, I'm off. You might see me again. But um, I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Nice, safe, fun. Enjoy yourselves. I should be on Wednesday, on Sunday. I We should be back on Wednesday. But if I don't see you, if I don't talk to you, if you're on vacation, you're out of town, wherever you're at, hope you have a fun, safe, great Thanksgiving. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Adios.